Hello everyone, welcome back to TechTed.com. Today we are starting a new category of video and we call it How to Solve. So in this category, we will be solving problems and we will mostly we will be focusing on how to solve problem, the approach towards a problem. So we have given a hashtag how to solve. So please share this video by tagging how to solve. Fine. So the problem to start with is which of the following sequence of degrees represent a graph and the graph which we are considering here is simple and undirected and the options given are as follows so this is very basic problem from discrete mathematics and from the graph theory portion and if we start solving this let's check the options one by one and think about the option whether this option is possible or not so starting with first option we have 2, 3, 3, 4, 4 and 5. Okay. So how to think about this? That whether this these degrees are possible or not. So first of all we will think whether there are even number of odd degrees or odd number of odd degrees. What I mean to say here is if you consider this is uh, odd degree this is a odd degree and this is a odd degree so here we have odd numbers of odd degrees so for a graph it is very important or necessary that the graph should have even number of odd degrees so let's write it down a simple undirected graph will have even number of odd degrees so this is the point which you have to mug up not really we have to understand why this is there this condition is there that only even number of odd degrees will be in a simple undirected graph. So let's try to understand with example. Let's say there are few vertices. Let's say A, B, C. Okay. So if you consider edge AB, each edge contributes to two degrees, right? So each edge contributes to two degrees here and here. So whatever be the number of A's the sum of degrees will be even right sum of degrees will be what even fine so if we have odd number of odd degrees the sum will become odd which is not possible right so odd degrees are possible but the number of odd degrees should be even fine so this is the option which is wrong we will discard this option now let's consider second option the degrees are 2 3 4 4 5 so first of all we will check whether there are there are odd number of or oh sorry even number of odd degrees and which is not the case here we have even number of odd degrees okay so first condition is satisfied which we just studied now Let's think about this degree 5. For a graph having n vertex, if the graph is simple and undirected, the maximum degree will be? Maximum degree will be how much? n minus 1. Let's understand this. Let's say we have here some degrees. Uh, some vertex and if we consider this vertex it can connect to the maximum vertex of this these three right these three so there are only three vertex from which it is connect so if it is not a simple graph and there can be a loop we can have some loop like this right but this is not the case we don't have this loop here and the graph is simple so one edge one vertex can maximum connect to n minus one vertex so if there are five vertex then the degree of that graph cannot be five or the the graph will not have a vertex for which the degree will be 5 so this is again a impossible condition 
let's consider the second option in this option the degree of vertices are 3 3 3 and 1 so there are four vertices let's say a b c and d c. okay and if the vertices vertex vertex a have degree 3 it means it is connected to all the remaining vertex fine similarly b also have 3 so it will be connected to all the remaining so it is connected to basically a c and d similarly c also have degree 3 so it has to be connected to all the remaining three vertex now this d will automatically be connected to all the remaining three so it cannot be the case that the in a graph where n vertex are there n minus 1 vertex have degree n minus 1 and the last vertex that is the n nth vertex or 1 vertex have degree less than n minus 1 ok so this is not possible there has to be complete graph and all the vertex will have n minus 1 degree fine now check for, let's check for the next option in this option we have n vertex having degrees 0 1 2 3 up to n minus 1 so we have to see whether this degree distribution is possible or not so if you think carefully here this last degree is n minus 1 so which we have already discussed that if a vertex have n minus 1 degree in a graph of n vertex then it means that the vertex is connected to all the remaining n minus 1 vertex right it is connected to all the remaining n minus 1 vertex so if it is connected to all the remaining n minus 1 vertex a vertex cannot have this 0 degree fine so here according to this it should be connected to all the remaining vertices but this is 0 degree which is not possible so both this 0 and n minus 1 is not possible together so this is again a wrong option now let's consider the last option which is given as 3 3 3 3 and 2 so the number of vertexes 5 and these are the degree distribution now if we check the maximum degree here for n minus that is n equal to here 5 but the maximum degree is 3 okay and the number of odd degrees are even here and none of the condition is violating so this is the only possible option and the correct option and we can draw a graph so let's try this let's say we have this five vertex so if we draw this will be this is two this is two so now let's let's fine and now we have four degrees which has degree three four vertex so if we match this so this is three and this is three now and again if we match these two vertex we draw edge here this is three and this is three so this is now a graph which is undirected and uh, simple so the best op method to solve these kind of question is starting with eliminating the options okay so just try to eliminate options and whichever option doesn't satisfy the condition we can eliminate and the remaining one will be the correct answer so i hope this is clear thanks for watching